Hello, and welcome to the Purple Pass tutorial on how to use the Mobile Box Office Point of Sale, or POS Terminal. You will notice that it is iPad-based, the case has a built-in scanning laser, a credit card swipe, a charging indicator light, a physical power button on the side, and a home button facing towards you. After opening the Purple Pass app, the first thing you will see is the login screen. Here you type in your Purple Pass email and password. Once you're logged in, select the event by swiping left or right and then click the Load Event button. The terminal will now download all of the data it needs to start. You will now be brought to the initial selling screen. In this video, we will talk about the two main functions, selling and managing orders. To start selling for your event, you will use the selling section of the box office. The workflow goes from left to right in three easy steps. What do you want to buy? How much will it cost? And how do you want to pay? On the very left, or step one, you will see all the ticket types available to sell. Selecting one of these, it will prompt you to choose how many the customer would like. After choosing the desired amount, confirm in the middle of the screen on step two by looking at the quantity and price. To add a different ticket type to the order, repeat this process. Next on the very right, or step three, choose the payment type. As you can see here, you will have the option to process cash, credit, split a transaction between cash and credit, or you can even comp the order. By selecting cash, it will bring up a calculator to assist you with the math. It is recommended to use, but if you have exact change, or you're a math whiz, then you only need to press proceed. Depending on your settings, you may be prompted with a pop-up giving you different receipt options. Let's go through another order using a credit card. After touching credit, you will be brought to a screen that asks you to swipe the card. Swipe the card either up or down with the magnetic strip facing towards the screen. For best performance, make sure the card is pressed in all the way and swiped in one swift movement. Again, depending on your options, you may be prompted for a customer signature. Flip the screen over and it will auto-rotate to their perspective. You can also simply rotate the POS. Your customer will now complete the transaction by signing their signature with their finger and then touching Proceed. Finally, if enabled in the settings, they will be presented with various receipt options. The last two payment methods are split and comp. Doing a split payment allows the customer to pay a portion in cash and the remainder by credit card. The last way to complete a transaction is to comp it. This option allows an order to be completed without payment. By pressing yes, you will complete the order and your customers will be on their way. Most importantly, after completing any type of order, you will always have a transaction log, which is on the bottom of the selling screen. This will show basic details about your recent transactions. If you touch one of the orders, it will bring up a prompt that, depending on your settings, will allow you to reprint a receipt, email a receipt, and let you refund the order. You may be approached by a customer that has chosen will call. You also may have a customer that misplaced their tickets and needs assistance. If you look in the upper right-hand corner, you will see a magnifying glass icon. Press this and it will bring you to the Search Orders panel. There are several ways to quickly search orders. The most common way would be to use the various text fields to look up an order. You will see different types of information you can search by. For the best search results, we recommend searching by either the order number, last name, or last four digits of the credit card used. Once you locate the ticket holder's order, you will simply tap on the person's information on the screen to view options for that order. The last way to look up an order is by swiping their credit card. To use this function, ask for the credit card used to purchase the tickets and swipe it while on the Search Orders screen. The order will pop up and then you can click on their name to view the options for that order. Congratulations, you have now completed the Mobile Box Office POS tutorial. Now go out there and sell some tickets. For more information, 
please visit support.purplepest.com, contact your service rep, or visit the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.